Hello everyone and welcome back to New Tech. Today we're going to compare the new D13 versus S20. We will see what we have in the D13 that we don't have in the S20 and vice versa. So let's begin here immediately with a D13. As you can see in the first page we have this beautiful face which we can change just by pressing it and holding it. We have four other different faces, you can see we can choose whatever we want. We have the first one as the T-Rex theme, as you can see we have weather, we have all the training and steps for throughout the day, at the top we will enter the menu from the, begin from the bottom, we have here training, walking, running and cycling, after that we have skipping, badminton, basketball football and swimming at the bottom of the training we have heart rate blood pressure blood oxygen as you can see that we have low battery right now which it alerts us we have blood oxygen messages shutter breathe and more in more we will find mute brightness as you can see different level of brightness and we have stopwatch about QR code reset and power off at the end so basically this is what we have here in the D13, so let's go ahead and see what we got in the other smartwatch. Here in the S20, as you can see we have QR code brightness, do not disturb. You can see different level of brightness, which we can raise and lower. We have the press to find the phone, we have here blood pressure, heart rate, we have steps, kilometer and other things throughout the day that we did. We have here state, these are all the data for one day. Heart rate, blood pressure that we saw before. We have here notifications, stopwatch, countdown, settings at the bottom. We will find here theme, which we have only two faces and that is basically not enough for my opinion. We have after that screen of timing which we can change up to 15 seconds and this will drain our battery faster but that's okay for us. At the end we have also system. So this is the software of the S20. Let's begin with some tests. So you can see now we have the D13 again in our hand, let's go ahead and try the first option that we can find here which is training. We saw before all the options that we have, you can see it starts immediately and we have the seconds at the top, burn calories, steps, we have kilometers and blood pressure. So we have four or five uh, options for the sport, which I think probably for us is enough. We have here now heart rate. As you can see, it's loading. Let's see how fast this will measure. And we have the first result right now. This is the first result, so it will still be measuring. And we have the end of the result, as you can see it says end, and all these results will be saved in the app for us later to take a look what we did throughout the day or week, which we can choose whatever we want to see. You can see now we have the blood pressure. And we have the final result immediately here. After that we will measure our blood oxygen and see what result it gives us. We usually see here the percentage of blood oxygen as you can see like right now. So let's go ahead to the other smartwatch and see what we got. So here we have the S20. As you can see the first option is heart rate. It says testing immediately, we don't have to click to measure it. And let's see how fast this device will measure our heart rate. As you can see we have the first result, which is fast enough.
and this is the final result i can feel a little vibration to tell you that the result is done we have here now blood pressure let's see this one how fast it will measure i think this will take a little bit longer than the heart rate you can see we have the first result here and this is the final result you saw the results change so after that we have here the sports as you can see that we saw before what type of sports do we have so let's go to the running because you can see we have time we have seconds or steps and burn calories which i think these are not enough for uh sport With only three options i don't think this will do about the data and other things so guys this was all for today's video i don't think we have anything else to test here thank you very much for your time and support if you find this video interesting and helpful please consider to like and subscribe turn the notification on and we will see you in the next video with another smartwatch